In this video, I'm going to show you just how easy it is to make your own video presentations. The software I used to create the journal rankings video was Prezi, P-R-E-Z-I. It is a PowerPoint alternative that instead of using slides, uses an infinitely zoomable canvas. For example, I can zoom way into that coffee mug over there, and I can zoom in even more, Whee! and then I can zoom way back out to view the whole canvas. So instead of going from slide to slide, I go from area to area, and I create these areas. For example, let's say I wanna create an area for these pens. Let me click on this pen frame, and I have right click the hand and say, add to path. It creates a step down here with the pens. When I click on it, it zooms into the pens. I can, I can also create my own custom paths. Let me show you, let me zoom all the way out. Let's create one around these headphones. I'll go to frames and arrows, draw invisible frame, draw a frame right here. And then let me select that frame, right click it, add to path. You can see it added it right here. If I click on it, it'll zoom into that frame. I can also insert an audio voiceover for that path, which is what I did for the journal rankings video. How do I create an audio voiceover? Let me show you that. I use a software called Audacity. It's free from SourceForge. And all you have to do is hit record. These are some really nice headphones, says the narrator. Stop. So it just records everything I say. It also records all the background noise though. So I'm gonna select this, go to effect, noise removal, get noise profile. That says this is the noise profile. And now select it all and remove that kind of noise from my audio. There we go, you can see how it's nice and clean now. I'm also gonna delete this headway here. There we go. And now you can see these are some really nice headphones, it says and that's what it sounds like. So let me save this file export as an MP3. This is um, example narration and save. Yep, save. And now I'll go back to Prezi. And for this frame, I'm going to insert an audio voiceover. Let me go find it, recent places. And it's probably at the bottom here, example narration, open. And we can see here it has that narration. Let me click on it so we have evidence. These are some really nice headphones, says the narrator. And there you have it. That's how you add audio to a step. Now, am I using any special equipment? No, uh, the microphone I'm using for this audio recording is a $25 microphone from my local IT shop. It doesn't have a fancy spit guard or anything like that. For a spit guard, I use my handkerchief. That blocks spit just fine and also blocks stray streams of um, microbursts from my mouth. How do I record the video? I present right here and I start the presentation and you'll start hearing some audio here in just a minute. This video offers a summary of the main but points while this in Lowry is presenting, at all 2013. Pause this. But while this is presenting, I'm doing a screen capture using Screencast-O-Matic. Let me show you that. This is Screencast-O-Matic. I'm actually currently using it to record this video, so I can't show you all of its nifty features. However, if you go to screencast-o-matic.com, you'll be able to see the short video tutorials they have on using it. It's a very simple uh, easy to use software and very inexpensive. It was about $15 for an entire year's worth of um, usage. And then you can use whatever you record and then upload it to YouTube or Vimeo or you can uh, save it as an MP4 file or something like that. And that's how you create a video. It's, it's really not that complicated. How long did it take me to create the journal rankings video? It took about five hours, including all of the image collecting and editing and all of the audio uh, generation and editing and all the animation. And that's all.